I just uh, received the Nest temperature sensor. I bought the three pack. I'm using this more to uh, monitor temperature in certain rooms that actually don't have heat or that the thermostat can't do anything about it. Just want to get an idea of how cold and how warm it gets in those rooms. More for storage. I want to get an idea of um, what I can keep in there. I have a storage room downstairs in the basement. It's off to the side of the home. So it kind of gets cold and hot in there. I like to make sure that what I'm storing is not being destroyed by the temperature. So let me just open it up. So this is the screw just to, uh, let me unscrew it, get to the inside. Okay, that's the inside and the battery. I have the nice thermostat third generation, so this should work with it. So that's it. Those are the three that come in there. These are the screws. Nothing else in the box. So this is all that comes. All right, let's set it up and see how well it works. I just wanted to show you the screw. I like that they give you everything you're gonna need to uh, use the device and mount the device. So, right here. Look at that, perfect. I'm going to be mounting most of these on the wall, putting one in my garage. So I'm setting one up right there on that lip, right outside, less than 50 feet away from my thermostat. I want to monitor the real temperature outside. Okay, take an electric screwdriver, screw right in. Fits perfectly. Awesome. Okay, so I'm gonna add the Nest device. The first one. Got the Nest app. Uh, hold on a second. 
go here. Okay, I'm at the add product. All right. So I'm taking the battery connection. The other side has the, the install for the device. Okay, got it. Looked, found it. Pull out the battery tab. I did that already. Uh, find a good spot for your next thermostat sensor. I already did that. And uh, I'm going to add it to the living room. Uh, bring your nest temperature sensor to the room where you will plan to keep it. Tap next to check the connection. Okay. Let me see how well it does. Okay, let's see, it's connecting. So Mike can, oh, it did very well. I think you can get up to 50 feet away. I wish it went through Wi-Fi. So, okay, that's gonna be the other setup for the uh, details on it. I'm gonna have to customize that. I just wanna show you, so I'm looking to put, it's that thermostat. So it's going to be that thermostat to the outside right there. So I'm not looking for this to increase that temperature. I'm just looking for the, to use it as a sensor to see the difference between the cold, uh, mostly for the cold in the winter months. This is the Northeast. The cold and um, just to see how much, uh, heat needs to be generated inside the house so you know if it's like 10 degrees outside and i have to keep the home at 50 you know it's a 40 degrees difference so i kind of like to keep those numbers at play um to get an idea of how much fuel i'm burning uh, we use oil so that's that one so i'm calling it front deck outside Okay, I did all that. I'll do done for now. See how it looks. So now, here it is. So it's, I guess, some kind of setting. And uh, I'm getting 68 right now. still sensing. All right, let me set the other ones up. Looking to keep track of the temperature outside in my, in the garage. So let's go out to the garage. So that's the garage and that's the home. The thermostat's just in that room on the other side of that window where the light is. So it should reach, it's only wood. No, like metal or anything. So let me see how well that works. So I'm looking to put it in that corner there just to uh, monitor the temperature inside the garage. And the home is right there. So it's right next to it. Okay, I moved a little bit to the right from 
where I was gonna install it. This is more of a direct shot behind it. And like I said, it's wood. Um, so uh, it should be no problem finding uh, the connection and making the connection through wood. And it's less than 50 feet away. So I just wanted to show you that the connection is going from here, that thermostat, going through this window and just on the other side right next to the window so um, like I said it's glass and wood so you know c communication between uh, wireless should be fine and it looks like it's doing a really good job finding it and making the connection it's giving me a good connection as you can see it connected very well no problems all right, let me customize the name and everything. So now I'm gonna add it to the location in the basement. So, the wood burning stove is right there. And um, this is how we use this is what we use to heat the basement in the winter. I'm actually putting the net thermostat uh, somewhere in the networking area. Probably just above the uh, Cujo firewall. In that area right there. Okay, five seconds later. Screwed it in. I love that they come with the screws and everything. You don't have to fumble around your drawers looking for screws. They give you everything. So that's it right there. Wood burning stove. I get an idea of the temperature down here. A more accurate reading. I have temperature readings and stuff like that. But I like Nest and it's nice to see it from, a, from afar or from upstairs. I'm looking to put another. I only got uh, three so far. They just came out, so, and I'm looking to put um, another one in this area. This is the end of the basement, it's about 1,500 square feet. So this is towards the back where the electrical is. And then this is my uh, storage area. And, you know, when I store things, I want to make sure that the temperature uh, doesn't get too cold for certain things because you know cold could really destroy some things so i'm looking to put one in here so i'll have a total uh that'll be a total of five and then i'm putting one in the attic uh just because it comes i'm going to buy the three pack because it saves you about twenty dollars if you buy the three pack um and i'll just keep track of that temperature but the five i definitely am interested in just keeping track of temperature. I'm not looking to increase heat here since there is no heat in the basement or in the storage area. I'm just looking to keep track of the temperature. All right, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you, bye.